YouTuber. So, um, running another user benchmark. Uh, this time on my i3 uh, computer I built uh, to do some internet surfing, uh, video capture, and other things. Um, currently, have uh, not done some of the upgrades I want to do, but uh, here's uh, a little bit of an idea of what's in the system. So it's got a gigabyte hard drive. Uh, got that at ASUS, or excuse me, at Amazon. Um, got a hell of a deal during Christmas time. Got it for $49. Um, then I uh, got 8 gigs of uh, G-Skill memory. Um, right now I'm using a 4K uh, computer monitor here. And operating systems Windows 10. Um, that's that info. So it doesn't have a uh, video card. Um, but it does have integrated video on the motherboard, which is, uh, I believe, Intel HD 630, um, which is, you know, actually pretty good. It's not the Ultra HD one, but the uh, the HD one. Um, sadly, uh, one of the video cards I just picked up, um, it's actually faster than it. It's faster than a NVIDIA GTX uh, 730, so... Uh, which is kind of funny but uh, you can see the performance um, gaming this thing's not really much of a gaming machine yet until I get a real video card in there they rated it at 16 percent as a surfboard desktop uh, it has actually pretty functional as a desktop giving it uh, 46 percent and for a real workstation um, they're saying 27 percent or uh, a raft um, PC itself uh, overall status is performing as expected in the 57 percentile um, because this is the uh, the i3 um, which isn't anything impressive uh, it uh, does get a green score though um, I imagine if I was using one of the crappier uh, i3s this is a 7th uh, gen uh, not the 8th gen like the other one that I did for graphics um, they give it a pretty low score um, where it does rate like a GTX 1070 at 100%. So, uh, curious what the 1080 is, uh, if it's 110. Boot drive, I'm planning on upgrading this to a solid state drive. Uh, the other computer I did have a solid state drive in and it was nice and green. Um, for what I'm running, this is saying, you know, 8 gigs is good enough and my uh, OS version is up to date. Um, so let's zoom down a little. So overall, um, gives you what you would have for uh, the different different cores, um, score-wise. Graphics, there you go, the Intel HD 630. Um, so nothing super impressive there. Gives you uh, some of the frame rates that it ran during its test, which uh, isn't very good. The hard drive that's in there is uh, one terabyte, um, so it's scoring in about average. Um, then when I ran this, I had a thumb drive in there, um, which is uh, giving it a terrible score. My RAM, I bought the um, 2133 megahertz, um, 8 gig DDR4. Uh, Should have probably bought uh, the max speed, but. Uh, I went to uh, save a little money, which, you know, might uh, come back to haunt me a little. But uh, overall, you know, um, score is what it what it is. Um, I'm going to work to improve this, and I'll do another video um, upon completion of some of the upgrades. Thanks for checking out my video.